Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I have turned off the fans for you guys. Today we're going to do a wig review, the first wig review on my channel of this wig right here from, I think it's Bush, Bussy Kanekalon Synthetic Blonde Hair number 60, 22 inch wig. So I've waited all day to get into this wig so that I can review it for you guys. And I already have my cap on. I had done like a sort of ball cap method with my hair a um, couple days ago. So anyway, let's get into this wig. This is the packaging as you just saw. Nothing really fancy, but good enough that I can store the wig in here if I wanted to. There is the wig here. And there's also a wig styling guy here. I don't really need that either. And I probably won't save the box either. I'll probably just put the wig in this bag. So this is what the wig looks like. It has a netting around it. Whoa. Okay, let's take it out what the hair looks like. Very flyaway hair, but so far doesn't feel like it's the kind of hair that's going to tangle up. And it has this piece of paper in it. So let's put the wig on first to see how it is going to fit. I'm looking at this lace. The lace is a light color or kind of transparent so I'm probably going to have to color this lace by with my makeup Okay, so they already cut baby hairs into this wig, which are really freaking long. But this wig so far is fitting really, really nicely. So I'm enjoying it and praise God, this is the kind of hair that does not tangle really easily. This hair is it's a dream. Yeah, it's not tangling. All right. This is um, lighter than what I thought, but very, very, I'm enjoying it. So how about I go ahead and trim the lace down. I might use some glue to secure it down just to be able to work it around more. So I'm gonna secure the lace down and I will be back once I style it. So, all right guys, so this is what the wig looks like now that it's on. It has a six inch by 13 inch free parting space. So that is one of the selling points of the wig. What I'm going to do is go ahead, like you can see the, front hairline is plucked pretty well. I need to put some concealer in here, but I also need to cut these baby hairs because honestly, they're <laughs> annoying me and they're almost as long as like a pair of bangs. So I'm gonna cut all that and come back once I lay this wig a little bit, okay? All right guys, I'm back. This is what the wig looks like. I have on my crown. <laughs> for my other makeup look, this makeup look that you're looking at. So if you'd like to see it, um, this video will either go up before or after the eyeshadow look. 
anyway, I have some observations to share with you about the wig now that I've kind of razored the uh, baby hair, laid that down. I use Got to Be Glue in the black container. Uh, so it's the clear gel. I didn't use the ghost blonde glue because I don't want to fight taking this wig off, especially since I go to work on Monday and I definitely will not be wearing this number to work on Monday. But, um, so if you look in the crown, do you see this like short hair? This is the only real complaint that I have about this wig because I don't understand why it has this this short hair up there like I use a little bit of gel to lay it down and if you got the wig I would say just do that use a little bit of gel to lay it down so that it's not flying away other than that um, the wig does tangle a little bit it is pretty long you can finger comb through some of the snags but it's nothing that a you know quick comb through won't fix and um it doesn't tangle nearly as bad as some other synthetic wigs that i actually own do to the point where i just want to throw them out so this is at the end of the wig synthetic wigs that don't tangle as much it's very much so bearable and it doesn't get like completely nappy this is what the hairline looks like this is what the parting space looks like looks like it has a huge parting space 13 by 6 inches and the transparent lace makes it look more realistic um part of me almost wishes that it was brown but that's nothing that some powder won't fix i just didn't put makeup on it because i don't want to stain the hair with my makeup my face makeup because that's already happened um where I tied my hair down and laid the edges but other than that I have no complaints about the hair it is bone straight so I will probably be using the hot water method to curl it and put some curl in it or braid it or I don't know what I'm gonna do with it yet but right now I'm enjoying it as straight hair um, I apologize if you hear anything in the background that is my daughter she's a teenager she's on the phone with her friend so anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video and this look, this review of the wig. Tell me your impressions. I'm going to leave the link to this wig down in the description box below um, because I am so happy with this wig that I'm pretty sure I'm going to buy uh, a darker blonde wig, um, the one that I originally was looking at. So yeah. Tell me what you guys think and I will see you guys soon. Bye.